This convocation, as you can see here behind me, all about coming together, really laying out a vision for the district and providing inspiration for the upcoming school year. A sea of staff Monday morning. We start off with a lot of excitement, welcoming everybody with open arms, hugs, kisses, smiles. And the sounds of excitement. I think it's really great to build the community feeling again and feel like, oh, there are other teachers like me out there. Joining us here is New Haven Superintendent Madeline Negron. Doctor, thank you so much for inviting us. Great turnout this morning. This yes. is your first year as superintendent. What's on your agenda? Uh, lots of things on the agenda. One of the challenges is chronic absenteeism. That is why we've been driving home the message that we need students in starting on Thursday, which is day one. Second is going to be the fact that we're still trying to fill every single vacancy because we need high quality teachers in front of our students every day. And something else that's really exciting, you're the first Hispanic superintendent in New Haven. What does that mean for a district like New Haven? I am very proud and very humbled that this community has entrusted me to lead. Yes, very proud that I'll be the first Latina in this role. And I am hopeful that many students who we serve, students of color, can see me, hear my story, which is one of perseverance, and that they will believe that they can also have a better future. And the first day of school for students, that is on Thursday. I will let the cheerleaders take it from here. Go, 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 go. And I will send it back to you in the studio. Perfect.